Hi, Michael Tebow here, Done For You Marketing Systems with this week's edition of Mike's Marketing Minutes. And hey, I just went to the movies this weekend and don't you like going to the movies? I love going to the movies. I saw Batman. Very cool picture if you haven't seen it yet. Um, and I'm not going to give you a spoiler alert, but what I wanted to tell you was how this local movie theater that owns several locations keeps me coming back to their movie theater when there's so many other choices. So you can use this in your business. So they have a loyalty program that I joined a couple of years ago. But you, you ever go in a, like a retail store or grocery stores are notorious for this, you know, and they ask you every time for your card, are you a member? And then you join and it's like, you never hear from them again and you don't get anything. It's like, why did I even join this, right? There's no benefit to me. So if you have a loyalty program in your business, which is an awesome way to keep your customers coming back again and again and again, but there's a couple things that you need with a loyalty program for it to be effective. So I'm gonna tell you what those are because this is an effective tool that you can use in your business to keep those sales flowing in and keep, put it like an iron cage around your customers. And this movie theater does a really good job of that. Now granted, um, they have the big recliner seats, right, that go back. You gotta be careful. You Sometimes I fall asleep depending on how good the movie is. Um, but they're always clean. They're always fully staffed. Uh, the movie theaters are great. They don't cram like, you know, 400 people uh, into a movie theater. So they do a good job of the customer experience. That combined with a customer loyalty program is a winning combination to increase your sales uh, from your existing customers. So this is an existing customer marketing technique, okay? This isn't for new customers. But three things that you want to remember when you're doing a loyalty program. The first thing is remember you need a very strong first offer okay and what i mean by that is nobody likes giving up their information right it takes time and you're like oh geez how many emails are they going to send me are they going to ask me for my phone number so you really need to have a good initial first offer to get them to join your loyalty program and uh just an example is join our loyalty program today if you have a restaurant you know uh, get a free appetizer or free dessert uh, that works because in today's world you have to give somebody something in exchange for their contact information so you can continue to market to them. Number two important uh, point to remember when you have a loyalty program is to communicate. Actually, that works with all different types of marketing, right? You, uh, once you get their contact information and they never hear from you again, like I said, that happens with a lot of the grocery stores uh, that I join loyalty programs from. You join and you never hear from them. What good is it? You need to communicate on a consistent basis with your customers. That's how you're gonna be successful. And third, and most importantly, a lot of people don't know about this with a loyalty program is how quickly they can get a reward. Here's another uh, problem that loyalty programs have. Um, like again, I keep going back to the grocery stores, but obviously there's one that I joined and you know I, I give them a lot of business and I don't get anything. So the quicker you can get an award uh, in their hands, and that's what I like about this movie theater that I joined because I see the rewards and I get a benefit for being a member. And that's how they maintain my business. Um, so, you know, they, they give me points. It's a point-based system. They give me points on uh, how many movie tickets I buy and popcorn because everybody knows the popcorn's awesome. They do a really good job, you know, with different types of popcorn at this movie theater. And you get points for it. And then you can redeem it for uh, free movie tickets or, you know, free popcorn snacks, whatever the case may be. But the quicker you can get a reward in the hands of your customers, if you have a loyalty program, the more successful it's gonna be. It's that law of reciprocity. So remember that, very important. Get them something quickly and you cement that relationship and start creating that habit. So if you want more information about a loyalty program, there is one that I work with called Royalty Rewards. And you can click the link below and you can sign up for a free 90 day trial. Um, so they do a really good job of helping businesses get their existing customers to come back more often. Thanks for watching this week and I hope you have a great marketing weekend. Remember, have fun and make money.